All right, you guys, I am Robert Arrington with Deer Meat for Dinner, and we were just out on the ocean catching some beautiful mutton snappers. My buddy Reef, that boy right there, caught this big old awesome 10 pound mutton snapper. Now, I'm gonna show you guys how I fillet a big snapper with just a little small knife. This is a new silver stag that I just got. Brad Smith sent it to me. And if you look right there, check that out. Aria, baby. That's my daughter, so, so stoked. Let me show you guys how I fillet a big snapper with a small knife. Okay, so the first thing is, you wanna make sure your fish is nice and cold. A cold fish is much easier to fillet than a warm fish. And if the fish is warm, it'll sort of mush apart and it's not good. Take your knife, go into this, you know, underneath the scales right there, just like that. Follow that back. And don't cut straight down, sort of angle it up into the head, just like that. Then take your knife here, work it right along that backbone, just like that. Make sure your knife is good and sharp. And then just follow it right along your right along the backbone. Now, you're gonna go right over top of the, the ribs, just like that. And that's a beautiful mutton snapper filet. We'll repeat the process on the next side. Now, that big carcass, I'm taking back to the house and I'm gonna make stock out of it. Beautiful fish stock. All right, so now I'm using a small knife and I wanna skin this. So I'm gonna follow right down this center line here, just like that. I'm gonna cut this out anyway, so I might as well do it now. Good. That sits there. This is going to be cutting out your pin bones. Just like that. Now I could throw that into the stock, but we have some fish here that love to eat it. And you just take it now. This is nice and manageable. Beautiful piece of fish. Skin comes right off. Just like that. Perfect. When you're bagging your fish, now sometimes we, we vacuum seal it, but we're gonna be cooking this tonight, so I'm not worried about it. You want your fish to lay nice, and flat in the bag, just like that. You don't want it all balled up. Make sure it's nice and flat, just like that. Good. Now you can do this in a bucket of water, or you can do it in our circumstance, just like this. Just take this, put it in the water. You can use a bucket of water to do the same thing. And this will just, the water pressure will push out all the air. There you go. Nice and flat, it's not gonna bend. Ready to go tonight. I don't know how I'm going to cook it, but we're gonna be eating fresh mutton snapper for Tasty Tuesday. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, uh, check us out in the, in the uh, comments below. And if you'd like to know more about Silver Stag Knives, the link to Silver Stag will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Robert Arrington, and I'm out.